Welcome to this video presentation, Documentation with Sagasi Studio. My name is David Clift and I'm an application specialist for First EDA. First EDA are a value-added distributor of electronic design automation solutions in Northern Europe, specialising in software and hardware solutions for electronics design and verification. Documenting your hardware design is a daunting task. It's a lot of work to document interfaces, state machine, block diagrams, etc. To make things worse, designs evolve over the course of a project. So the drawings always need to be updated after all the code changes are completed. This can cause delays at the end of the project. Drawing a complete state machine diagram or block diagram in Visio can take one to four hours per drawing. Worst of all, this is a manual operation, so it's prone to error. How many modules does your current project contain? How many state machines? Wouldn't you want a solution that's just a push of a button? Let's see what Scarcy Studio can do to help us with that. Here we are in Scarcy Studio. As you can see, we have currently in the editor a VHDL structural netlist. Um, it's quite hard to look at this as with any netlist and see the flow through the design. This is one of the reasons why block diagram representations can be so much help in cases like this. So let's open the block diagram window. So here we have the block diagram created by Sagasi. You can see we can double click on any block and it will take us to that block within the design. We can select a port and jump to that port within the design. So as you can see, the two are linked together. This is very useful. Now this is a structural diagram. What happens if we give it some RTL? Well, here's a piece of RTL. And when we use RTL, it links to the blocks in our design. So here we have a process called uh, Blackjack Machine. And here we have a concurrent wire assignment. So it's very similar, very powerful. Now, this piece of RTL in question is actually a state machine. So a state machine bubble view would be quite helpful for diagnosing this. So let's open the state machine window in Sagasi. So here's the state machine view of this piece of code. We can see how the states are interconnected. We can also see that it highlights dead and trapped states. Again, double clicking will take us to the state assignment in the state machine. One of the final pieces of documentation that we could have for our project is a written description of what it does. What do all the ports do? What's the description? What files depend on it? Again, this takes a lot of time to produce, but Sagasi can help us with that with the documentation window. Here we have the documentation window. This, like the other views, is a live representation of what we have in our code. And here we can see we have comments on our signals, and these are reproduced in the documentation. Again, this is a live document. So if I edit my code, you'll see That the documentation view updates. So add a bit more. So you can see immediately it updates. We have details of the internal signals, instantiations and block diagrams, although in the preview they're not rendered. So let's see the generated result. We'll click the Save icon, we'll select the project, and we'll select Finish. Pages are rendered, and the document is opened. 
we can see that this is for the whole project so we have every entity and architecture within that project we can jump to those projects and you can see we have the file dependencies we have descriptions we have architectures we have the block diagrams all of those rendered in Sagasi. So let's summarize. Sagasi Studio will automatically generate block diagrams from your HDL. This is a live document that updates as you modify your code and gives you a record of your structural connectivity. It can also automatically generate FSM bubble diagrams from your code. Again, this is a live document that updates as your code is changed. It will highlight deadlock and dead states, making debug of your code easier. Finally, you can generate high quality PDF documentation direct from your code, extracting the comments that describe your code. It will embed block diagrams and add hyperlinks for navigation. Thank you for viewing this video. I hope you found it interesting and informative. If you require further information, please visit our website at www.firsteda.com. Thank you for listening.